got uh, another spindle here. We're going to go back to our fault detection. And here it's not saying an imbalance problem at all. It's saying bearings are unsatisfactory. So uh, we go and look at our yellow here. Scroll down to our very last read. Well, we can look at our trend as well and see that obviously it was a problem before. It was replaced or fixed. And now it's been for months uh, doing well. But now an incident happened and now we're crossing over the yellow threshold. And we can see that again in our waterfalls. We can see everything going well. And then the last few readings, things are escalating. So let's go back look at the last spectrum and see if we agree with that. We're at about 2.7 G's, which isn't, I wouldn't put it in the red either. It's not going to fail immediately, but we definitely have a bearing issue here in the high frequency domain, seeing our running speed over here and seeing that these bearing frequencies are elevated and heading in the wrong direction. So you can see again, this app can very quickly work with you and enable you to be able to find these faults and find these problem areas right away through this heat map. Uh, we thank you very much for your attention. If there's any more questions at all, please reach out to us on the web at www.gtipredictive.com or reach out to us at our number at 603-669-5993. I thank you very much for your attention.